Hey guys, Antonio here with another chapter in Thinking Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill. Today we're going to talk about the power of the mastermind. Um, so, what is power? It's organized effort and intelligently directed knowledge. So, when you have some a bunch of knowledge, right, you might not necessarily be organized. You might not, not necessarily be the right kind of knowledge you need. But when you have the right kind of knowledge and organized in a certain way, directed towards a certain goal, then you now have power when you're acting on it. That's what it is. Knowledge is only potential power, but when you organize it and direct it in a certain way with action, that's when it becomes power. So what is organized effort then? And what is a mastermind? It's when you have two or more people that work together for the purpose of achieving one goal. So um, you must be in a spirit of harmony when doing this in order to achieve the mastermind effect. And what happens with the mastermind effect is you have two minds that are working together. They're almost on the same frequency. So when you're on the same frequency, you, tend to, you end up creating this third, more powerful mind that's invisible between you two. And you might not think that this is like possible. Like Obviously, they're not creating a third mind. Like You're stupid, Antonio. Why are you saying this? But if you actually have been in a scenario where you've a simulated a mastermind before that you would know um, if you've ever had a brainstorming session with a friend where it seemed as if your ideas were flowing off one another where you said something and then your friend said what if we add this on top of it and then you then you came back and said oh my god that's great what if I add that on top of it instead or what if we took out this and added that you guys are commuting on the scene you're communicating on the same frequency and your minds have connected into one bigger, greater mind with ease communication in between. But when you try to communicate with someone and you're angry at each other, how many times have you ever been able to come up with ideas until you've gotten into the same spirit of harmony? Probably never. It's really just a lot of yelling at each other or a lot of attacks at each other. So when you're in a spirit of harmony, you're both working towards one goal, then you'll be in a mastermind. And I used to not believe that this was something that was important. I was like, I could do everything on my own. But um, recently, a friend and I have been doing mastermind sessions, and we both have the purpose of you know, becoming better people and achieving our individual goals. And we talk about them with each other once a week. And we've realized now that as we're saying them to each other, we've come up with so many greater ideas on how to get us farther and how to move us ahead. And we've now been able to catch ourselves in real time as things are happening in real life. So there's something that I might have talked about in the mastermind meeting. And then I see it happening later in the week that I'm about to make the same mistake again. But I end up catching myself because I've communicated with my mastermind partner. And both of us have acknowledged that this is a problem that I have and I need to overcome it. And when doing that, I'm now catching so many things in real time and it's benefiting me to making changes in my life so much faster. Having this other person that's there for you to help you get towards your goals and you help them towards you help them get towards their goals, you now both accelerate and help each other get up and move a lot faster. So, hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Power of the Mastermind. Please leave me a thumbs up guys if you enjoyed it. Um, I'm going to leave a link in the description down below for you to purchase a copy of this book. Stop everything you're doing right now and buy this book. Do it. Now. I'll give you three seconds. Okay. Hopefully by now you've clicked on the link. Now go buy the book. Go ahead. Oh, wait. Okay. You should have bought it by now. It's pretty easy to buy something on Amazon. Um, so, this book will help you out greatly. I can only give you some of the information. You can read all of it in the book. Guys, as always, subscribe and have a wonderful day.